There aren't too many families that have five generations. I never thought I would live to have a great, great grandchild. And I think it's important that people know their ancestry a little bit, to be able to say, well, this is my great grandmother, this is my great great grandmother. And of course, it's always nice to say, this is my great great grandson. So th that's why I'm here, because I think it's something for posterity. I saw you there at the edge, souls are thin from walking. I'm doing it for my family, because they do a lot for me, too. And I think it's important. And I think that we deserve it. Maybe I am the end of the road. I would describe them as they're all nuts, but <laughs> like, <laughs> I agree. Yeah, they're all nuts. Our family is very stuck together, and everybody knows everything, and everybody's in everybody's business, but they're just joyful and they're very heartwarming people. Ruth and Roberta are both such hard-working, dedicated, and loving. They have the biggest hearts. My grandma saved me, basically. She has the biggest heart of anybody I know, and she's so caring, and she is really brutally honest. <laughs> grandma Ruth has just been, like, the sweetest person I've ever known, and she's so smart, and she's always on top of everything, and. They're both pretty much like that. They're just both really incredible people. Yeah. She's my best friend. We are. We're on the same wavelength about a lot of things so that we understand each other better. That's true. It's like I said, she's my best friend. I can always count on my mom being there. You should be able to. <laughs> and I do. <laughs> I love the heart that Dana has. She's just a really kind person. With that kindness, though, comes a lot of hurt for her. But that's her biggest attribute, is her kindness. Elizabeth is fun. I raised Elizabeth. She's like my own daughter. She looks at life totally different than my mother or I do. Totally different from Dana. And I love that she loves her son so much. And as far as Noah, he's the apple of my eye. I mean, he's just, that's my great grandson. How often do you get to say you have five generations and you have a great grandson? And he's just a joy. Well, your grandchildren are an extension of your own children, for one thing. I have a lot of grandchildren. I have a good relationship with all of them, and I think it's because they're accepting. I mean, you know, let's face it, I'm, I'm not 18, I do have my flaws, but we accept each other the way we are, and, and I think that's important. Who else can you get mad as hell with, and the next day you give them a big hug and a kiss, when it comes right down to its family? We all know life is fleeting, and we don't know how long we're gonna be here and you don't have an opportunity to have five generations that often.